the artist at work. No, the artist at play. With the painting and other projects out of the way, and the weather being as nice as it was, Cecilia was very anxious, very excited to, to start planting. Up until this point, we had been taking all the plants that we had bought and putting them in the garage, garage every night, and then bringing them out in the sun. But uh, we decided, okay, we'll, we'll plant some of them. And so, uh, here we go. For our area, the last frost is typically sometime around May 21st, 22nd. And it's not really recommended to put any plants out um, before then. But uh, we were feeling optimistic and we decided to take the chance. Afternoon snack. One more. One more load. And then my husband deserves an ice cream. Pistachio. Pistachio's ice cream. Is that pistachio's ice cream? Yes. Oh, I thought it's just mint. My husband enjoying his ice cream. How is it, Han? Excellent. It's the best $4 I ever Mmm, so good. So really good. We were sitting here the other morning having our first breakfast al fresco um, of the year. And, well, the table rocked a little bit and the chairs rocked a little bit and they were kind of hard to adjust. And so we decided uh, maybe this area needs, uh, needs some work. So we're going to use some, some of these 12 by 12 pavers and kind of extend what I, what I've done here in front of my workbench all the way over all the way over here to the back of the fence and then around to that border kind of make this a nice flat area where we can set up the table and chairs and enjoy some outdoor dining well I'm sure loving these uh, these tulips. Cecilia's not a big fan of tulips, but I kind of insisted on me buying some bulbs and we planted them last fall and oh, I think they're gorgeous. Beautiful color. So these are our, our hanging strawberry garden and uh, that looks promising. There you can see Cecilia's newly painted pots. Add a little
little a little more color to an otherwise very dull garden. Joke. Joke long. <laughs> Joke long. Joke long. Those hostas are looking really nice in the in the tulip patch there. Looking good. And as promised, those apple blossoms are starting to explode. So we're starting to prepare this this space here for the pavers. We'll get all the gravel out of here. We'll bring the dirt down to uh, the appropriate level and then put in some more landscaping fabric and sand and we'll get, uh, we'll get those pavers in there. So when we started digging here to uh, level up the soil, we discovered that um, the irrigation pipes are are much higher up than we thought. They, we figured they were buried a little bit deeper. So that's going to put a crimp in how much how much we can level this up. Where are they? See. We've just gained a whole bunch of good black dirt. Five hours later, we have our new little breakfast nook or lunch nook. So this is our umbrella stand for this area and we thought we'd try something a little different. So it's been a very uh, busy and productive week and um, we'll leave you with uh, this beautiful view of our pride and joy, our apple tree this year. We, uh, we hope you enjoy this show uh, and we hope you'll join us again uh, next time when we bring you another episode of Cecilia's Garden. <laughs>